The city of Raleigh received $73 million from the American Rescue Plan to bounce back from the pandemic. $10 million of that was used to buy a hotel. This is an interesting concept here. The CBS 17 reporter Judith Rotana is getting some answers tonight on how that purchase could help fight homelessness. For people having a hard time getting into an apartment, an extended stay often becomes home. This one off Capitol Boulevard and Brentwood Road is now owned by the city in hopes of fighting homelessness. Buying a hotel is certainly a first for the city. Erica Brandt is a city's housing programs administrator. She says of the hotel's 113 extended stay rooms, two dozen will be converted into permanent supportive housing. It's hard to work. It's hard to get an education, provide for your family if you don't have that kind of stable platform. Platform. So housing is really essential to just providing folks stability. Buying and renovating the building will cost about $10 million. Raleigh split its $73 million pandemic dollars into five categories. This is the only project under the housing category so far. And I think it'll probably be a couple years before all the all the upfits are complete and every, but everything is kind of as we um, envision it now. We're already starting. The nonprofit CASA will manage the building and provide resources like job training. They focus on affordable housing for the last 30 years. We do need to have some innovative strategies uh, to accommodate uh, the people that are already living here. CASA CEO says growth in the region has resulted in increased rents and the pandemic only made things worse. He hopes CASA's partnership with the city can keep people off the streets and help them bounce back. As many people that uh, live in the Triangle and across the country uh, were close to uh, having a, a crisis, uh, and then the pandemic, you know, brought that crisis on. And while this hotel project will take up a lot of resources from the city, there are other projects under the American Rescue Plan funding that will cost exponentially more. The single largest ticket item is online in my story at CBS17.com. In Raleigh, Judith Ratana, CBS17 News.